future. My name is Joshua De Silva, I'm 21 years old and I'm an actor cricketer for Trinidad and Tobago. Um, I always used to play cricket in the backyard, so that's probably how I got into it, but I never really started playing hardball cricket until I was in Form 1 in St. Mary's College. That's when I really started getting more into the game. I've been playing for about 9 years in total, um, that's just from Form 1 secondary school up until present. Um, football is probably secretly still my number one love. Love football, always have thought I would be a footballer. Played into college school growing up, but at the last moment I just chose cricket and it's been going well. My favourite sporting venue would have to be in New Zealand, the Queenstown Event Centre. There's an airport just behind, so any in the Middle East, the planes taking off and landing, so it's a wonderful site and a great venue to play at. Uh, my biggest fan of fans would have to be my parents. They're always supporting me and they're always there. At every game they can be at, once I'm playing at home they're there and once I'm away they either try to come or they'll be watching on the stream or on TV. So it's either way, they're always there. My favourite sports person... Uh, it's kind of a tough one. Um, would have to be Steve Smith. I just love his attitude towards the game, his work ethic and everything about him. He's, he's different what it takes to be the best in the world. Netflix or YouTube? have to be YouTube. I spent hours upon hours on YouTube. So yeah, that's, that's a no-brainer. Um, definitely Instagram, you know, because I don't really use Snapchat as much, maybe when I was younger, but now more Instagram, building the brand and whatnot, so try my best and just, yeah, Instagram is the way to go. And Furious 2, yeah, Paul Walker, of course. Um, rest in peace, but yeah, that has to be my favorite movie. I'm not really the biggest music fan, so it's, I just listen to all genres of music, so I don't really have one. Um, my advice for younger athletes would be keep sticking towards your goals, don't give up. It never too, it's never too late, especially you're young. So keep pushing hard, be disciplined, especially that once you treat the game, whichever game you're playing, once you treat it or once you treat it right, you will reap the rewards and once you put in the effort and the discipline and all the hard work, everything will fall into place. Um, there have been a few. I would say David Furlong, Andre Lawrence, Floyd Reefer, they've definitely helped my game a lot and they've helped me to be where I am today. Uh, my proudest moment in sport would have to be winning the Super 50 uh, regional tournament with the West Indies Emerging Players. Even just being the underdogs and nobody expecting that to happen, it was a dream come true for all of us. We didn't make our franchise team, so just to win the tournament and beat all the expected winners, we, we were so happy and yeah, that's my most memorable moment so far. I'm just doing some exercises in my backyard, in, my, in the front, I have a little driveway in the compound, so I'm just doing some sprints, doing my body weights, just trying to keep active, uh, doing my best to, with the facilities I have. Thanks for watching, stay safe, sanitize, stay home, let's help Trinidad and to extend the world flatten this curve. We can only help ourselves, and once you're staying home, it'll only benefit others.